Hi, welcome back to Stephen Funky Family. On today's video, I'm gonna show you how to cook soto ayam using Instant Pot. So I just got this Instant Pot from my birthday. So this is going to be my first attempt or first experience on using Instant Pot. And because the title is Instant Pot, so we're gonna use instant seasonings here. So by, start by you know, chop chop off your all of your vegetables, and here I'm showing you uh, the coconut milk I use. Brand is Kara, and the seasonings from Indonesians. Uh, you can buy this very easily in any Indonesian stores. So start by plug the cord and uh, press that button in the corner, left corner button, and uh, that means saute mode. I cannot believe I use Chinese uh, versions of Instant Pot. So the time I set for 8 minutes and now I just wait until the pot start, you know, sizzling, sizzling or something like that. That's how you call it. And then I start pouring the oil. Next is the seasonings. So in this case, because I'm afraid of the explosions, I cook uh, or deep fry a little bit. Uh, the chicken separated so now you can see the oil starts sizzling and then saute is kind of like stir fried in the beginning of most of indonesian's cooking style you can definitely skip this step the stirring part and you can just go straight to dump all of your chicken and the carrots and naturally at this step you can uh, also add some cabbages and the uh, what how did you call that green sp green sprouts or something like that well the sprouts uh, but you don't want to mix with the greenish leaves kind of vegetables such as spinach and stuff like that. They just don't go together. Anyways, um, next step is I'm going to pour a little bit by little bit my coconut milk or coconut cream by Kara. So usually if I cook this kind of dishes in the regular pot which is with the stove, I would keep stirring until the coconut milks uh, or the coconut cream slowly dissolve uh, because I don't want to break it down because it doesn't look good and tastes a little bit weird so in this case I put a little bit of water not so much but I choose boiling hot water hot boiling water because I don't want two different things you know cold hot because we already start with the saute mode right and i heard an instant pot if you use the hot boiling water uh, it will help the pressurizations uh even faster it's kind of like you know cooking even faster a little bit about on the screen the saute mode usually it will start counting you know change from on to eight minutes counting down so here i turn it off the saute mode because I want to put all of the what garnish such as the celeries and the green onions and then well you know stirring is something in my blood so then I just uh, cover the lid until the until the pot make the sound like <laughs> sure the flavor is okay and then I color up right see you can hear so for this one don't forget to put it this way see there's no more fog or smoke positions because of the smoke or the whatever moisture out uh, a little bit hard I don't want to touch this area okay so now we press this and then we press uh, up 10 maybe it's better we try five minutes first okay and then just leave it just like that it will start by itself There you go, and then start counting. You need to make sure that this is off, okay? It will 
will start uh, pressurize something like that. classifying the dinosaurs. Yeah. <laughs> Good job. 